Montgomery County launches a program to help serve our local heroes who have spent their lives fighting for our country. Two News reporter Kelly King has new information and how that initiative is working. Some 40,000 veterans in Montgomery County now have a voice thanks to the Voices for Veterans advisory group. The group is designed to help improve the services they receive. Standing up for those who stood for our country. Uh, I think it's very important that our veterans are empowered uh, to be able to uh, know that if they have an issue that they don't stand alone. A veteran himself, Montgomery County recorder Brandon McLean, formed the Voices for Veterans advisory group. A one-stop shop centralizing resources for our veterans made up of those who've served and those who haven't. The volunteer group provides a safe haven for our former military members to voice concerns and offer up suggestions and critiques of the services they're getting. And that's not all. This group is about ensuring that our veterans have the opportunity to request a second set of medals uh, or possibly even inquire about uh, a veteran discharge, which could be very important when we look at uh, the fact that the DD-214 is essentially the access point to benefits for veterans. It joins the the recorder's other implementation of the Veteran Identification Card Program, connecting vets to earn benefits. About 2,000 veteran ID cards have been issued so far. We're moving in the right direction, but we still have so far to go to ensure that our best receive the best. The group holds meetings on the last Monday of every month at 5.30 p.m. Reporting in Dayton, Kelly King, 5 on 2.